Hello and welcome back to Maths Plus. We're continuing on the 2022 Leave Insert Ordinary Level question 6. So the first question is to find the angle inside the circle ADB is the angle between the two cards. So remember from the junior cycle we had this theorem where two cards from the same diameter will meet at an angle of 90 degrees at the intersection. So therefore ADC satisfies this condition. ADB is equal to 90 degrees. So that's good because we need that for the next part. So AOD is 130 degrees, and we want to find the angle X up here. So what, what do we have near X? Well, we know that the angle up here is 90 degrees in total. We can get this angle from the triangle down here. So let's work that out. So in triangle AOD, we have this set of values. We have 180 degrees as a total. We have 130. And also we have two other angles. So let's call them Y. So 180 minus 130 minus 2y is equal to 0. 180 minus 230 is 50. So therefore bring it across and 2y is equal to 50 degrees and y is equal to 25. Right, so we're not there yet. We need to go back to the angle ADB is equal to 90 degrees which is also equal to x plus y degrees we're solving for x we know why so let's bring over the the angle of 25 we're going to subtract that then from the 90 and that would be equal to x so therefore x is equal to 65 degrees So the radius of the circle is 18 centimeters and we need to find the arc length AD. So you do not need to know this formula but you know you need to know where to find it in the log tables. So the arc length formula is found on page 9 in your log tables and it's here in the second line on the left. So the length of arc L is equal to 2 pi r by the angle subtended up here over the total 360. So let's use this formula and substitute in all the values. So the length of arc, length of a d, let's write it like that as a subscript, is equal to 2 pi r. Okay, so r is equal to 18 centimeters going to substitute that in here and then we're going to substitute our angle in as well so we can see there it's 130 so it corresponds with the arc and let's work it out so if the answer is in terms of pi what we will do is just concentrate on all the other numbers with your inputs and just put pi on the side here. So 2 by 130 over 360 multiplied by the 18 for the radius. So we will get 1, 3, pi. So that's it and it's in centimeters as it's linked. So on to part B. So we have two questions related to geometry and the questions are about 
similar triangles and congruent triangles. So let's look at the statement. So two statements A and B are shown below. So this is statement A. B is in the next part. So for state for each statement, put a tick in the correct box. So statement A goes as follows. If two triangles are similar, then they are congruent. So we need to define similar and we need to know what congruent means as well. So let's look at similar triangles. Well, similar triangles are triangles which have the same shape. So the shapes are the same. as they have the same angles. They could be a different scale, okay? So if they're a different scale, okay, so if the scale is changed, but they retain the same shape, then they will not be congruent, as we need to have all the sides the same to be congruent. So the answer here, you've guessed it, is false. So if they're similar, then they, then uh, being congruent is not is not is not a must. Let's look at part B. So if two triangles are congruent, they must be similar. Well, this is the converse argument. So let's look at congruent triangles before we start. So we have side here, side, angle, side. Or else we have side, side, side. You can see they're all the same. Or else uh, angle, side, angle. But we don't have angle, angle, angle is not congruence, which is similar triangles. So the reason here is that the it's the answer is false. Well, it's true. It's true that they, if they are congr if they are congruent, they must be similar. So that's true. And the reason is that um, the angles will be the same. The angles will be the same. And that's just the condition for similar triangles. Okay, so I hope that makes sense. And remember to subscribe to the channel and watch out for the next free video.